everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be testing for you the four lipsticks that came in the iHeart Revolution and Shrek makeup collection. I am so excited to try these out for you. I have been doing testing videos with them and I will leave all the other Shrek videos that I've done below because I absolutely adore this collection. And in case you're wondering what's on my eyes, I have done a Halloween video and this was the makeup look from it. So that will be up already. So I will leave that linked below as well. I did use an iHeart Revolution eyeshadow palette for it and I just love it. <laughs> anyway, on to the lipsticks. I will leave all my other Shrek videos below. These are the four lipsticks that came in the collection. The gingerbread one, Fiona, Dragon and Donkey. On the top you can see the swatches and yes that Fiona one is green for a very good reason and I will show you shortly. I did decide to pick up all of the collection of lipsticks because I thought they'd be very good for my videos and they just had a very nice variety of shades which I didn't have in my collection so I was very excited to pick them up. These did sell out originally but I do believe they have been restocked now. The first one we'll look at is I think my favourite from the collection. It's the Fiona PH Transformation Lip Balm. This is what the packaging looks like. It's got Fiona looking all cute on the front. You've got a swatch of the lipstick on top and yes that is green. So I'll show you why in a second. This is what the lipstick packaging looks like. As I've said in my testing videos I'm a really big fan of the way they've designed these lipsticks. I think for any makeup collector these are brilliant. Inside you've got gold hardware and then you've got this green lip balm which I have to say is the most Shrek thing from this collection. I just think it's insane. When you look at it obviously it is green but it is a pH changing lip balm. This means it's a neutral colour but then when you pop it on your skin depending on your pH levels it will actually go a rosy kind of pink colour which I think is so cool. If I swatch it for you on my hand you will see that it slowly does appear with a pink leave it there for a second. There you go, you can see the pink appearing now. What I love about the texture and the formula of this one is it does feel really nice on the lips and it does give you that lovely little rose tint which I think is so cool. And the fact it's been really thought out well with the Shrek and the Fiona sort of transformation thing, I really like that. I'm going to pop this one on my lips first. As I said I will be testing all of the lipsticks in this video. So I'll try this one first. It does feel very glossy and balmy. I really like the feel of it. And it has such a pretty healthy looking tint to it. I think it looks absolutely lovely. I have been reaching for this one quite a lot. I've done quite a few testing videos with the Shrek collection. And I have to say, this is the one that I've been reaching for the most. I just think the idea behind it is really good for a Shrek theme. And I'm just a big fan of pH changing lipsticks. I think they're great. That was me testing the Fiona Transformation Lip Balm. The next lipstick I'm going to test from the iHeart Revolution Shrek collection is the Donkey Lipstick. Never thought I'd say those words in my life, but here is the Donkey Lipstick. He looks so cute and innocent and happy. I really love him. And then inside you've got this beautiful sort of donkey coloured, concrete coloured lipstick. I really like it. You've got him jumping around all on the packaging and he looks really happy. And then inside you've got this beautiful nude lipstick. It's kind of on a cooler tone, I'd say. But I'm going to swatch it on my hand now. Swatch wise, next to the Transformation Lip Balm you can see the tones are completely different. The Donkey lipstick has a very warm tone. I didn't think it would be. I thought it looked quite cool toned. But it looks like a daily one that you could wear for work, something like that. And I just think it's a really nice colour. Out of the collection, I'd say the Donkey one and the Fiona lip balm are the most neutral tones. You'll see why in a moment. But I'm going to test the Donkey lipstick now. Formula wise, that is really creamy and I am loving that colour. It's applying beautifully and it feels so soft and moisturising on the lips. I absolutely love that colour. I definitely think I could wear that for work. And I think actually it suits my skin tone quite well, which I'm very happy about. And when I saw this, I did immediately think this looks like a kind of daily grabbing lipstick. It just is so pretty. That was me testing the Donkey Lipstick from the I Heart Revolution Shrek collection. I think this one is probably my favourite so far. Next up I'm going to test the Dragon Lipstick. This is what the box looks like and she looks so cute and happy. I really like the characters on this. And then the swatch on the top is a very crimsony red colour and I thought it'd be perfect for the Christmas season and just perfect to have that Taylor Swift sort of red in your collection if you don't have it already. I thought this looked really nice. This is what the packaging looks like. It's a beautiful crimson red 
with the gold dragon printed on it. And inside, as always, you've got the gold hardware and this beautiful red toned lipstick. It's definitely what I'd describe as a Taylor Swift red lipstick. And I think it's just absolutely beautiful. I'm gonna swatch it for you now. The formula feels so rich and creamy. It's really nice. And it definitely does have that classy sort of red to it. And I'm very excited to have this in my collection. I do think it will be very useful for makeup look videos. And definitely one of those ones that you'd grab around Christmas time just when you're dressing up and wanting to feel cute. So I really like that. I'm going to pop it on my lips now. I really like the colour of that one. I did used to wear red lipstick an awful lot when I had really dark brown hair. But since I've had blonde hair, I haven't really worn it. But I really like that colour. I think it's a very classy red. It goes very well with the black colour that I've got on today. Probably not my eyeshadow, but... <laughs> I really like it. I think it's a very kind of grungy red. It just looks really nice. And I think it's a perfect staple if you want in a red lipstick in your collection. That was me testing the Dragon lipstick. And finally, we're gonna be testing the Gingy lipstick. It's a different formula to the others, but we'll have a look at it now. This is what the packaging looks like. He's looking very cheerful. And then the swatch, as you'll see, is a matte color. I'm excited to see what the formula is like. I've just heard it's different from the other ones. This is what the lipstick packaging looks like. It's in a beautiful little pumpkin orange color. And then, well, I suppose gingerbread orange color. <laughs> and then you've got little Gingy floating around on there looking happy. And then you've got the lipstick here. When I saw this one, I wasn't going to pop it in my basket, but then I thought, hmm, I might get some good use out of this because it's so unusual. And I have got quite a few autumnal palettes, which I want to get out and use. So I'm excited to see what this looks like. I'm just going to swatch it on my hand now. It definitely does have a different texture to the others. You can see the pigment is so bright though. All of these lipsticks are really high quality. And looking at the swatch up close, it's kind of an orange toned red. It's a very nice unusual one. And as I said, it is a matte one, which explains why the texture and formula is different to the others. I'm going to pop this one on my lips now. Straight away I can feel the different formula but it does feel moisturising. I think this is one of those reds that's maybe a bit dark for my skin tone currently but I really like the colour of it. I think it definitely is going to go well for some people with autumnal eyeshadow palettes. And to be honest, it does have a really nice shine to it, even though it's a matte one. I'd say it's not totally matte, but it does have that kind of flat texture to it. It does feel really nice on the lips, and it's a very unusual one. So if you like bold colours, you might like the gingy one. That was me testing the I Heart Revolution Gingy Lipstick. You know what? This flipping smells of ginger. I've just gone to do a like little thumbnail thing and it smells of ginger or gingerbread. Is that the same thing? Probably. That smells really nice. <laughs> if you don't like gingerbread, then you might not like this one actually, but I mean, I think my eyes can taste it now. But that's a really nice surprise. I didn't expect that to be scented. Mm. That was me testing the I Heart Revolution and Shrek lipsticks. I absolutely adore these. I think my favourite thing was the surprise of the gingy one smelling like gingerbread. I thought that was so cute. And especially as it's coming out around Christmas time, that's a very Christmassy scent, so I'm really happy with that. I think overall my favourite is probably the donkey one. Definitely the Fiona Change in Lip Balm, because I think that's just so cool. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you do want to see more, you can follow me on Instagram. That's at Zoe Glitter, Zoe with a Y. And I am up uploading every day at the moment so if you want to see more makeup testing videos then please subscribe i'll see you in the next video bye